Hey guys, Technomentor here with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to force restart or reset your iPhone 11 Pro Max on the latest iOS version. So let's get started. So a force restart is something you want to do as a first troubleshooting step if you're having any issues with your iPhone software, whether app's not working, screen isn't responding, it's not charging, whatever the case is, it's going to be the very first thing Apple recommends doing. In order to do that, first thing is you need to locate three different buttons. First one is the volume up and then volume down on your left hand side and then this big side button on your right hand side. In order to do this, you're going to press and release the volume up followed by press and release the volume down one after another and finally hold this side button until the screen goes completely black and once you see the Apple logo appear, you'll let go of that button. So let's get started. So I'll do volume up volume down and then I come over here and hold this side button make sure you press volume up and down quickly if Siri activates that means you didn't press volume up and down quick enough and after that you're gonna hold that button on your right hand side until the screen goes black and then once you see the Apple logo you let go of that button and we're gonna be rebooting normally so what we have done is shut down the phone completely and then have it reload the code so that if it's a software related issue causing your phone not to work correctly it will fix those problems for you and once you're back on you should be able to get back to your main screen now this method of a force restart will not delete any of your personal data so all of your photos videos apps and data will all be there you will not lose any of your data but this is something you need to do in order to troubleshoot and fix any sort of software related issue on your iPhone 11 Pro Max and I hope this video was helpful and fixed your problem if so please make sure that like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices see you guys next time